Good morning, guys. Sending you positive energy, guys. Good morning. It's a Friday. We're gonna run. And then we go wake up the kids. No, we're gonna run. I'm gonna make breakfast. And then no, we're gonna run or take a shower. And then go wake up the kids. Oh my gosh. So I need you positive energy, guys. I'll just do one kilometer as usual. And then go wake up the kid. Oh my gosh, I'm waking up. I'll do one kilometer. Go take a shower. And then go wake up the kids. That's the plan. Alright, let's do this. Sending you positive energy, guys. What? What did I do? The treadmill doesn't want me to send you positive energy. Come on, man. Sending you positive energy, I'm sending you healing energy. You woke up, the biggest challenge in life is won. You woke up, not everybody did, unfortunately. Sending prayers and condolences to the families of those that didn't manage to wake up today. So, you and me managed to wake up today. Let's not take this day for granted. Let's live for the people that couldn't make it. Waking up is such a big challenge that not everybody get to do it. So the fact that you and I woke up, let's not take this day for granted. Let's go after our goals. Let's mend our relationships. Take the ego away and call your son, call your daughter, call your mom, call your dad, call your grandma, call your grandpa. For your uncle, your cousin, your aunt, your grandkids. Don't wait for them to call you back. You are thinking about it, so you just do it. You have nothing to lose. Trust me, they'll be glad to hear from you. Whatever pain is in the past, let bygones be bygones. We don't have the luxury to take every day for granted. Oh, I'll do it tomorrow. Do it now. You don't know if tomorrow you're gonna be here. We live in the present, we have experienced the past, we don't know about the future. So let's do everything that we want to do now, today, because we are here. Protect your peace. Be selective of the people you surround yourself with. The energy is contagious. So, feed your soul with good energy and energy people, and good energy people. You're amazing. Be thankful for everything. There is no such thing as a small blessing or a small opportunity. There's just a blessing and an opportunity. So be thankful for all of it. Trust me, the universe hears. If you are very thankful and you appreciate everything, you are opening doors for more blessings. Because nobody wants to give someone who is not appreciative. So be thankful for everything. Trust me. 
the more thankful you are, the more appreciative you are, the more you receive. The more blessings, the more opportunities you receive in life. So always give thanks. Enough of a charity party, I'm gonna run. One K. And then take a shower. Take a shower. Okay. Oh my gosh. That's the worst feeling, it's just stepping on your kid's toy. So, it's time to get a shower. <sighs> Alright, I've taken the shower, cold shower by the way. 
and it feels amazing. You just I drink my glass of water. We might drink a glass of water, guys. It's healthy. It's important for your body in the morning. Let water be the first liquid you put in the in your body in the morning. So I have a dishwasher, but since I've been living by myself, I can't have, I can't wait until I have a lot of dishes to wash them. I can't have the patience of piling the dishes until they're enough to wash them. So I haven't used the dishwasher in like three, four months. I used it yesterday. How long is it safe to keep a dishwasher without using it to avoid the mold and oil and stuff? Because when I started yesterday, I started hearing like mm -hmm, for like the first five minutes and then it just started running smoothly. So if you are specialized in this and you know, just tell me when is the perfect time to use the dishwasher, to, how long you can keep the dishwasher without using it. Because I like using my hands to wash it. It takes me back to when I was in Africa doing wash using hands, so I never use the dishwasher. Mainly to save electricity, energy. Also, I can't stand having a lot of empty dishes. Empty dishes. I can't stand having a lot of dishes and wait for them to pile up so the dishwasher can do the job. I always try to wash them. Okay, enough of the chatty pie. Let's wake up the kids. Underneath that? Yeah. Is it not going to be too thick? Two jeans? Yeah, I know. I'm going to make something, but I can't find something else. Can you help me with that? Uh, we can, on tomorrow we can buy some more like uh, leggings that you can put underneath.
Where are they sending? Because the jeans is too thick. This is much more thinner. Okay? Okay. But you're wearing an un underwear underneath, right? Yeah. But I get nervous. I'm nervous? I, no, I... Don't put on that way. No, just put any as a button. Okay. Why do you feel nervous about it? No, it's just... It's okay. You sleep well, alright? Good morning, Amias. Yes. You sleep well? Why are you scared? Because you have underwear underneath, okay? But where? Just wear the green without, because uh, you have an underwear underneath. That looks like shorts, okay? Yeah, but I choose to wear another t shirt. You can what? Sorry? I'm wearing another t shirt. Okay, but you know what? Sounds good. You know what? or just a different shirt? Yeah, I want to. And we're also a different, a different look. I'm trying to find some shirts, but if I don't find so any I want. Tomorrow, tomorrow, we're going to buy, you know those black, uh, long shirts, like tights, like a, like a black trousers that I, I came with, but short ones, so you can wear, and then they're like on your knees. Okay? Mm. Should I bring something else then? Okay. Should I take this back while wearing this? And this too? Mm. Oh, you're wearing this? Mm. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's okay. Mm. You wear this? Yes. Thanks. You're welcome. Saturday. Tomorrow we are buying small shorts, like like long, like tight, but up to your knees, like black ones, so you can wear the, them underneath your skirt. So if it's too warm, you can wear something under it, so you don't feel. Okay. You, yeah, you're welcome. Start dressing up now. Money, yes. Yes. Love you. Thank you. Sleep well? Yes. Good job. Alpha 
press mute and form. Sister, come on, Elias. Elias, please. Come on. Elias. Okay, mm, just small. Okay, I give you a bread.
remember just uh, your starting screw you needed for me. Do you want to cut it? You want me to cut for you? If it's raining, mm -hmm. I take my air umbrella to with me. Mm -hmm.
Thank you for the food. Thank you for my daughter. Thank you for my son. I praise you, man. All right, guys. I'll eat. We eat, and then we see you guys when we're going outside to the cars. I'll eat too now. Dad? Dad? Yeah. Camera's still on. What? Yeah. No way. No way. I'm coming. I'll bring it Yeah, Daddy, you know it's still on. you guys in the car so how do you feel about today going to school okay. you're not nervous anymore right? okay. um, that day I'm nervous mm -hmm. and after sorry I don't get it. Never seen him, right? That's good. Alright, so I love you so much. Thank you so much for yesterday. And thank you for this morning. I love you so much. Have a good day. I'll pick you up as soon as possible, right? Try to hurry up a little bit, but don't fall down when you are. Love you so much. So much, okay? I don't like actually run, just like a like power walk. But not like actually. Ah! Hey, though. Love you. Say bye to I will. I will. Love you. Love you too. Dear Father, I come before you. 
to pray and ask that you watch over my daughter, watch over the school, watch over the teachers, watch over the kids, watch over everybody that's gonna pass through this uh, this location. I pray and ask that you bless every parent that brings their kids here. That you bless every parent that brings their kid here. Give them guidance and patience. Give the teachers patience, guidance, and understanding and strength. I pray and that's the same way that I leave my kids, the same way that I'm going to pick up. Protect their peace, protect their energy. I pray that every parent, the same way they are leaving their kids, the same way they're going to pick them up so they can go to their loved homes safe and sound. I praise you. Thank you for everything. Amen. Emias, are you ready, buddy? Emias? Emias? Yes. Are you ready? Yes. All right. It's raining. Can you feel the rain? Yeah. It's coming. Emias, look. I'm going to do this rain coming in my mouth. <laughs> look, 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 look. The birds. <laughs> Again? One, two, three. Go. <laughs> the rain is beautiful, right? Yes. Nature is beautiful. <gasps> And yes, look, look. You see that? It's a big rat. You see? You see that? Oh my God. It's a big rat. All right, it's Friday, my brother. Have a good day, okay? okay. I love you so, so much, Emias. Yes. And I'm proud of you, okay? okay? You're my best friend and you're a good boy. You're a good boy. I love you. Do you want a wolf in the rain? Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four. Uh, ooh! One, two, three, four. Let's do it in the rain. Okay. One, two, three, four. Uh, ooh! Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do I have rain on my face? Look, rain come on my face. Look. I see all this garbage. Oh, the garbage. I see all the garbage. I love you, okay? Mm. A quick word of the day. I'll try to give you this code before I get to the car. I've already sent you positive energy, but I'm sending you positive energy again. A quick word of the day is a short one. Your version of you today is better than the version of you yesterday. So imagine all the great things that you did yesterday. Today, you're going to do even more. Every day... We always have to strive to be better version of our yesterday's version. So everything that you did yesterday, if you did something great yesterday, today you have to make sure that you improve it. You do even more greater things because you're amazing, you have the potential. Nobody's stopping you but yourself. So just get out of that uncomfortability, comfort zone that you are in and try new stuff, trust me, there is more life outside your comfort zone. If you did something you're not supposed to do yesterday, now you know better. Correct your mistakes. If you can't correct them, forgive yourself, move on to better things. Okay? Ah, I almost made it. I almost gave you a quarter of the day before I got to the car. So, uh, yeah, forgive yourself and move on. Sometimes, this is how it starts. I'm supposed to just give a short speech and here I go telling you a documentary story. Anyway, sometimes the stuff that keeps us from progressing or moving on is ourselves because we hold on to so much to so much unnecessary stuff unnecessary baggage unnecessary trauma well 
there's no such thing as necessary trauma after oh my goodness oh wow guys look oh my god look at that so you have the rain and then you have the sun that's the most beautiful sun i've ever seen with the rain and then the clouds guys i'm sending you positive energy may these showers of rain wash away all your sorrows all your pain all your struggles all your anxieties all your fears amen and may that sun bring light into your life bring you warmth bring you peace of mind bring you life bring you joy oh wow that was so beautiful jesus christ that was amazing nature is so beautiful the rain the clouds and the sun Nature is always teaching us lessons. Like I always try to get to make uh, to take life lessons from nature. So the rain, the clouds, we can use the clouds as the burdens, the burden that we have that is blocking our light from shining. The sun being us, the light we have. The clouds being all the hardship, the sorrows, the traumas, the anxiety, the hardships, everything. And then the rain, because when it rains, the, the clouds melt and then disappear. So the rain, we can use the rain as cleansing. You know, we are cleansing ourselves. We're letting go of all the hardship, all the fears, all the anxiety, all the <sighs> misfortune, everything, all the hardships, all the disappointments, abuse, everything that symbolizes the rain the rain we are washing ourselves clean off all the patterns everything so the more we cleanse ourselves the more the, the clouds disappear and then when the clouds disappear that's when that light that we have can shine through so that's the lessons we are taking away from this the weather today we saw the rain we saw the clouds and we saw the sun trying to just no matter how many clouds there was we could see the light so that's how strong of the light we have in us no matter how many people stand in our way, our line is always going to shine through. So, that's, actually, that's the code of the day. Forget the code of the day that I was telling you about. Today, that was the code of the day. The rain that is raining now symbolizes us cleansing ourselves. And the clouds symbolize all the hardship that stands in our way. All the pain, struggles, anxiety, disappointments, sorrows, loss, everything. And then the sun symbolizes our strong light that we have, our strength and courage to pull through. No matter what we're going through, our light is always out there shining. So that's the core of the day. Damn, that was amazing. Just the whole scenery. Whoa, it... Sending you positive energy, guys. I see you at work. I, I even forget what I wanted to tell you, but that was great. This whole sort of thing is nice. I, I appreciate you guys. Thank you for experiencing that moment with me. I appreciate you. See you at work. Hey. Come along. Wow. Well, all right, guys. It's a Friday. Start your day on a positive note. Your whole day is going to benefit from it. What up, bro? If you start your day on a negative energy, it's going to affect how you interact with people, the decision you make. So start your day on a positive note. And protect your peace. See you at 4 o'clock. I love and appreciate you guys. All right, guys, it's Friday. Hope you had a good day. I'm just going to go home now. Pick up the kids. Uh, no, but actually, I need to... Uh, yeah. See you, man. Yeah. I need to go buy a, a small cake to celebrate Selma's uh, second, second grade. And then... Hey. Um, okay. <laughs> Because it's a big thing for us, so I have to make it special. So I'll buy a small cake so we can celebrate our second grade. And then uh, I go pick up Emmy as it's home. So that's the plan. So see you either when I'm picking up the kids or I'm buying cake. Hey there. Alright, so I've managed to buy the cake. Thankfully. But I have to make sure that I... It's in the bag that um, I've... I remember to lift the bag correctly, otherwise it's going to be smashed. So I just need to pick up Amias and then sell them and then we go home. I don't want her to know that uh, I've bought the cake today. 
So it's going to be a surprise for her. So I'll see you when I'm picking up the kids. Look who we picked up. We Thanks. Look who we picked up. Thanks. Look who we picked up. Hey! I missed you, Emias. Missed you, Papa Ganosh. Did you have a good day? Yes, Papa Ganosh. I'm not Papa Ganosh, you Papa Ganosh. You Papa Ganosh. No, you Papa Ganosh. You Papa Ganosh. You Papa Ganosh. I love you. Love you. Kiss daddy. You Papa Ganosh. Kiss daddy. Kiss daddy. I love you, buddy. Let's go pick up Sam, okay? One, two, three, four. Ow. Come on. One, two, three, four. Come on, man. Sister gong. No. Yes! I... Okay, sister gong. One, two, three, four. No. Oh. Again. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Oh. Oh. You tricked me! Those glasses look cool. Wow. Oh, I'm sorry. That's okay. Wait, my bed I should pop it. What? They put it here. Fuck it. Hi. Look at him in his face. He was like... It's good to see you. Same. I missed you, sweetheart. I missed you too. How was it there? Good. Oh, what is happening? It rained a lot today. Yeah, it did. Have hey. to. Uh, la, 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 la. We go to Ika and buy bread and that chocolate yeah. thing so we don't have to yes. struggle like today. And then we go home. So you guys, I'm not going to film when we're in Ika because it's going to take a long time. But I, I want to keep this vlog short. So we'll go to Ika and then we'll see you when we are home in the house. Alright, we are home now. I'll give this guy a bath. Second. I want to go for it. Great. 
Maybe it's three. I think but then we need to buy two back. Uh, two packs. But then we have four. And it's kind of two packs. No way. Dee dee dee. And yes. You want to get away so you don't cry? Okay. You want to come up with me? Or you want to sit there? Come up with me. Do you want me to light them up for you? Yes, please. I'm so scared to use one up like that. But you know you won't, you won't burn you. No. You won't burn you. safe if you're going out it's a weekend or celebration or anything uh, protect your peace and then you're watching this on Saturday so be safe throughout the weekend and uh, uh, see you I, tomorrow yeah? can I bring my phone yeah 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 sure anyways I'm gonna end the vlog with your toe yeah. you do it this time I'm gonna end Three key MS. Then you should see what I did after.